This program is brought to you by NT Kino. Are you the Territory's next millionaire? Play today for your chance to win. Hello again. It was a pleasant dry season day today with the humidity almost non-existent and the mercury in the high 20s. For much of the day, the city did climb to a top temperature of 31 degrees this afternoon. Right now, it is around 25 degrees Celsius. Let's check out tomorrow's weather maps now. A high moving across southeastern Australia will maintain sunny conditions and fresh southerlies for the Territory. A trough will trigger gusty winds to Tasmania, Victoria and South Australia. Across Australia tomorrow, nothing but sunshine in Brisbane, Sydney sitting on 19, Canberra climbing to 15, Melbourne maxing out at a mild 13, showers in store for Adelaide and Perth heading for a top of 21. Back home, Sunny and Catherine 31, flying south, a brisk night for Tennant Creek rising to 25 tomorrow, even colder in Alice Springs, minus to the low, morning frost forecast there and in Yalara, clear skies, 21. On the Darwin Harbour, seas below half a metre, winds southeasterly below 10 knots, increasing to 15 knots later in the morning, tending northeasterly in the Arvo, a low tide of nearly 3 metres around midday, rising to 5 metres at 5 o'clock. Catch of the day time now, and today's winner is Ivel Beck reeling in a mega 6.5 kilogram cod. Nicely done. She caught this one out in Dundee. What a beautiful part of the world. Send us your catch from across the territory to newsphotos at 9.com.au. On shore tomorrow in Palmerston, 32 the top. One degree warmer for the rural area. And in Darwin, sunny skies, 31. Scanning the seven-day outlook now. Almost mirror image days forecast for the foreseeable future. Although on Sunday, it will feel a lot hotter. We are expecting the humidity to, to increase. We have some very sticky northwesterly winds forecast, making it feel almost three degrees warmer than what it actually is. So make the most of these dry season days while they do last, PT. Yeah, pretty pleasant, that is for sure. Thank you very much for that, Jack. Appreciate it. See you tomorrow. The share market took today's huge inflation number in its stride, managing a modest rise. Here is Chris Collar again. An extra 15 points was added to the ASX 200 today. Commonwealth Bank shares are back within reach of $100, while CSL and Toll Road operator Transurban also helped push the market higher. Mining companies were lower, with the exception of gold miners. Rio Tinto this afternoon announcing a lower dividend for shareholders than they were given this time last year. And today's inflation data pushed the Aussie dollar down against the greenback. It was buying 69 US cents, but it was firmer against the euro and the yen. That's Chris for you. Thank you very much, Chris. And that is Nine News for this Wednesday. Now, if you've got a story that you think we should be following, why not let us know via our Facebook page or, in fact, our website address as well. In the meantime, there's updates throughout the day, but we'll be back tomorrow at 6 o'clock for another full hour of your Darwin News Bulletin. In the meantime, from myself and all of the team here, we wish you a very good night.